Alright guys, so as you can see, there's a pretty big difference. Okay, so that sounds really great. It looks really great and it, it is just like a commentary how it should be. So I think this is all you guys need to know. Make sure to just apply some color correction or brightness and contrast onto your clip. Make sure that your microphone is, co is, is configured correctly. <laughs> What's happening guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new Vegas 14 tutorial and yes, I know guys, there's no face cam because this video was actually recorded at 1am, uh, so I'm just going to just record lots of videos, make them all be great and just go ahead and uh, just quickly make this uh, bulk uh, series of videos, but don't worry guys, next week I will be back with Facecam. Before you guys are going to spam, hashtag bring back Facecam. I know there is no Facecam today. There will be no Facecam in the deep web video of Monday and the Photoshop tutorial of Tuesday. But there will be a Facecam in the Vegas, for, uh, Vegas 14 tutorial uh, that's coming next Wednesday. So make sure to just stay calm. This is just one video without Facecam. So I would say let's get started. So as you can see right now in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a gaming or like how, how to make a commentary in general. General, and I'm going to uh, use a gaming commentary for this. So as you can see, I have some Overwatch gameplay right here. And what we're going to do is we're going to commentate over this. But first, before this video starts, I want to ask you guys to smash 300 likes. That should be easy. So make sure to just go ahead and do that. And let's start off. So as you can see, this is the Overwatch gameplay, like I said. And right now, what we're going to do, the first thing is we're going to lower the volume of the game sound. Because it's really loud when you're going to talk over the video. It's going to be, it's going to be really distracting and annoying. So we're going to lower the opacity of the of the audio to at least 12.7 decibels then we're going to cut away some of the waiting uh screens as you can see there's no need to show this just waiting so i'm just going to just start and cut from where the game starts that's right here i'm going to delete this part so just press s on your keyboard then we're going to add in a nice fade in i'm going to make it start at the beginning so this is what the gameplay already looks like So that is your gameplay, that, that, that looks really great, but as you can see, the screen isn't really um, like popping out. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to a uh, right click, we're gonna do properties, and we're gonna un uncheck maintain aspect radio and disable the resample. You will notice the difference, but it's just a really small detail. So that's one thing. The second thing is we're gonna go to video effects and we're gonna scroll all the way down until we find uh, brightness and contrast. And I'm going to just, as you can see, I have a lot of templates. I'm going to just pick my videos template, drag it on top of your timeline, and boom, it looks way, way better. So let's see what it looks like right now with all the settings on full. Alright guys, so as you can see, there's a pretty big difference. I'll show you guys right now. There is a difference between this and this. Do you guys see the difference? This one is the first imported footage to this. Boom, a lot of, uh, lots more saturation. So the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to record our voice in Sony Vegas. You don't need to uh, use Audacity like I do for a separate program. We're going to do just do that in Audacity. In, in, I mean, in Vegas 14, you will be just fine. So what we're going to do is we're going to add in an audio track, as you can see boom then we're going to click on this little red icon make sure that your microphone and everything is plugged in and configured then we're going to click on it i'm going to just click on ok and now as you can see the sound bar is popping up what we're going to do is we're going to press record and we're going to commentate over there i'm just going to pretend that i'm going to record a commentary for story time so i'll show you guys what i mean <clears throat> What's up guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new Storytime episode, and in this video guys, I'm going to show you guys uh, about the ad boycott that's going on right now, so more than 250 uh, companies have pulled out from YouTube because ads were showing on extremism videos, and everyone's revenue has been dropping by at least 25%, I believe. Okay, I'm going to cut right there, but as you guys can hear while I'm talking, this, the volume of the game is still too loud. So I'm just going to lower that to 18.8, uh, and uh, let's hear what my commentary uh, looks uh, sounds like. But as you can see, I'm clearing my throat right here. I'm going to cut away that. I'm, gonna just, I'm just going to cut to where the sound is starting. So I'm going to delete that. So let's see what it looks and sounds like. 
What's up guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new Storytime episode and in this video guys, I'm going to show you guys uh, about the ad boycott that's going on right now. So more than 250 uh, companies have pulled out from YouTube because ads were showing on extremism videos and everyone's revenue has been dropping by at least 25% I believe. Okay, so that sounds really great. It looks really great and it, it is just like a commentary how it should be. So I think this is all you guys need to know. Make sure to just apply some color correction or brightness and contrast onto your clip. Make sure that your microphone is, is, is configured correctly. Just start recording. I'm just going to uncheck this one because this bar is actually pretty annoying. So that is how to do it, guys. This is how you record a voiceover. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope this video was helpful to you. Make sure to smash the like button down below. Let's go for 300 likes that should be possible that should be easy so i want to thank you for watching i'll see you guys tomorrow for a brand new evolving into a brand new youtuber episode as always on saturday so i will catch you guys tomorrow just alex helford